Hello and welcome to Veterinary Practice Marketing Leadership Tip number four. Making the invisible visible. Let me ask, why do vets undercharge? I've heard lots of reasons why vets undercharge. People in this area can't afford to pay any more. Or if we don't match the vet down the road, we'll lose our clients. Or we don't want to upset our clients. Or we don't want a reputation as expensive. Now these are all seemingly sound reasons, but they're not based on fact. The truth is not charging your full worth is a huge mistake and it actually harms your clients along with your profit line. First up, it's folly to prejudge what people can afford. Be honest now, how many times have you waived at least part of your fee for a client who gave you every impression that they couldn't afford the treatment, only then to watch them go outside and put the pet into their brand new BMW. <laughs> now, here's an even bigger question. What is expensive? A fee is only expensive in the client's eyes, especially if they've been pricing around, that is, until they're educated as to why your price is what it is. Take a routine spay, for example. Sure, the prospective client may have phoned around and got a cheaper price, but that doesn't mean to say you have to match it. What it does mean is that your team needs to be trained in how to educate the client to all the invisible behind the scenes things that make up your value. For example, do you carry out a full clinical exam? Do you do a blood test to give peace of mind that the pet's organs are up to the anaesthetic? Do you do three layers of suture for the comfort and quick recovery of the pet? And so on. Again, pet owners have absolutely no idea of what goes into procedures like this. And until you educate them, make the invisible visible for them, of course they're going to focus on price. Take the lead and teach your whole team to be proud of your price and train them in how to educate clients on the value.